hey y'all hey friends hi guys welcome back how in the world go and hope everybody all right hope all is doing well welcome back to my channel thank you guys for watching if you do not forget to like comment share and subscribe this is episode two of my gardening series um here i ran to home depot and i also gave you guys a tour of my flower beds in the front um next episode will be a tour of my seedlings thank you guys for watching love you guys I was supposed to be recording you while you were doing my shopping, Lloyd, and I didn't. Home Depot run. And my helper. <laughs> yeah, my helper. I don't have to lift it today myself. I don't have to lift it today myself. And I don't have to lift it tomorrow by myself either. So yeah, went to Home Depot to get some soil. And this is new to my Home Depot. It's supposed to be better. So hopefully, maybe I'll have bigger, stronger plants this year. But why are you packing the powder on about this though? Hi guys, so we're at the Home Depot. Get in. And I got these for the front. Got these for the front. Yeah. Hey Lord, I'll put back the, the I'll put the, the buggy away while you do that, okay? Hi guys, I'm coming from Home Depot. I have help today for the for my lifting, so I don't have to do any lifting today. Look, in my van. And here comes Mr. With the, with the, with the, with the wheelbarrow. You need help, Lloyd? Do you need my help? Huh? Do you really need my help? It's too windy out here for this. You put them on that way, put them on that thing. That's where you go put them. Why don't you put them on this? I don't want to put them up there. Obviously, I know not go to them. Put back there. I mean, I made a video about it actually. Well, yeah. So the, the boxes that I put along here last year for the flowers did not work out because once the tree damp. started, um, the leaves came on the trees. It was too shaded, so I had to get rid of them. So those are the boxes that I actually have now in the garden that I'm going to use for food. And I'm just going to clean this up and fill it up with gravel because it didn't work. We still hopefully one. Stuff. Hopefully one year we can get a gate. Cause people are nosy. It's a small street and people are nosy. And we can get a gate like goes like right here to so block off the backyard. That was a plan we moved in. We should get wood that expensive for the COVID. Then this, uh, this one, I kept this one. As you can see, it has the tulips. Oh, that's another peony. This? What? Oh, I don't know what the heck. Some plant. I guess we'll see when it comes up. 
So yeah, this one, the squirrels, man, the squirrels are just killing us. They keep knocking off the the, the head of the plant. Obviously, we're just now getting into where, where good weather where we can come out and clean all of this up, rake it up and clean it up. Barely, it's still kind of cold. Yeah. Like gross. Who needs this? Transplant. Now I'm gonna put this into that. Um, I don't want to put this into that. <laughs> Down here. I did not know that, but now I do. Yeah, so that's why there's nothing here. The power stuff is down. It's everything has to be removed, but just in case. But yeah, I want to put this in here. But you see how it's supposed to come big? And then, like, try and put it in the house. Yeah. Um, and then, of course, my struggle garden. That's um, a little coming up big this year. Oh, I see. Yeah. yeah. So there's stuff all over this in this garden right here. This is my one of my flower patch, one of my flower beds. There's stuff everywhere. The tulips came in really good this year. Yeah, you can't step in here. Uh, yeah, basically cause... you have to be careful with yourself because there's always stuff coming up. There's something coming up right there. Stuff there. There's stuff planted mm -hmm. everywhere. I don't remember where I planted stuff. The tulips came in nice this year. If the squirrels would leave them alone, it came in pretty colors this year. But I bought more. I did it. Oh. Yeah. I'm a big one to them in the ground. This needs to be filled up a lot more. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. This one, that's going back right there. Yeah, those are the um. Yeah, this is a timing rose. I feel like I should just get like an arch thing, put it on it, and just let it do its thing. Mm -hmm. So now we dig it out. <laughs> it was dug out. We tried to get rid of it, but it came back. So guess what? I'm gonna leave. Yeah, it this out. is not the original plant that was there when we bought the house. No, we dug out the, the old one and it, it, it came, came right back. back. Yeah. That was cut down mm -hmm. multiple times and it came back too. The same thing. Oh, that the one over there didn't come back. I decided to buy it a sibling because, or a partner because it's, it's surviving and it's actually pretty and it's kind of big. Remember we came here, it was small. It's gotten big, I think trimming it made it grow faster. Mm -hmm. So I'm a, I bought it a, fa a, a family member that I'm going to put right over here so that it could have a quick. And I also oh, look! Bought, um, the bulbs grow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I also bought. We have the most random soil. We have the most random soil. Sometimes it does. Some some things grow in it. Some things just yeah, don't. I'm gonna dump them because I feel like the ones that I did, I did what? some. But the ones I dug up, the ones I dug up, died. They literally, you can see, the squirrels, all of these, mm -hmm. the squirrels literally destroyed all of them. That fence they come out of would be perfect. You then I put them over it, like protect them until they're big enough. Yeah, the ones I dug up died out, but the ones I didn't dug up, so I'm going to get them over there. So I'm going to dug up them. This is the, my original peony. That has died and come back forever in a day. There was one right there too, and one in the back garden, which I probably will be up to the front. There this right here. There's supposed to be another climbing rose. It's just, I don't know. It's just not climbing. And then, of course, we have the. This is supposed to be some type of tree. I didn't say the, the things I know the name of this thing. Honestly, I don't remember. It's a flower. And then, of course, we have the hydrangea. Another one over there. These are mints that come back over here. This is where the mints were? Mm -hmm. It's a mint. That's a mint too. I didn't realize this was a window.
Tell them your plan for here. Tell them your plan for here. Okay, she wants to extend this and plant more. Oh yeah, I want to see how it's small right here now. I want to come to like about here to, to extend this. So if you want to extend this one here, also make sure you have to plant more, more tulips and more of these flowers, more everything. Like, not the big ones, small flowers along here. From here, look at this. That side? Yeah. yeah. But remember, this is this Mother, people are coming down the street. Year. Let's hurry up. Remember last year, I just started this one. So yeah, I'm going to extend this out here. So I can add more. It's coming in, so that's good. Like before, we're like, it's wet, it's still cold. Ajayda, are these having calls and bag? And Ajayda? I look like her. Oh, maybe not. What? Say something. I'm recording you. Say something smart. I'm recording you. <laughs> He's been difficult. Okay. Hi guys. It's windy. I don't know if you can hear me. Um, I bought these two. I think I, sh I showed in the first part of the video. I bought these two from Home Depot yesterday and as you can see, the front of the house is, I have this garden that is my struggle garden, right? My flower bed. I've tried so many different things in here. And I decided I'll try these because they'll go tall. They'll bring some height to the garden. And then they'll also, yeah, they'll bring some height to the garden. And I feel like they'll also, you know, block out those brown things on the bottom and also um, bring a little bit of shade when they get taller. So yeah, I bought those yesterday at Home Depot and we're about to plant them in. Um, if you see, these tulips came up so pretty beautiful and then those ones, they're just not surviving over there. So we're about to dig those out and transplant them over here. Transplant them over here. Huh? It's gonna go in that, um, yeah, yeah. Cause we could probably do that with some of the dirt we just bought. The dirt we just bought, Lloyd. I knew I needed more. You're the one who didn't want to lift it. Say one little bit here, right? Right here. It's too close to my 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 um. I guess we're gonna move the rose bush. Yeah. We could transplant that rose bush. Hmm? Oh, you put it, it will perfect for the rose bush. No, it's gonna shadow the rose bush once it starts getting big. Yes, it will. Yeah, right there. You make it sound like something's going to be like weird fruit or something. Well, the rose bush is. Yeah, I thought that's what she was about to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what she was about to do. Isn't that that deep, Lloyd? You turn a Bible machine. Make sure the bulb is there. I didn't buy no machine, he bought a machine. I don't know what you bought. Make sure the bottle is there. What are you say, guys? Say, to Yeah, but they don't last long. What do you mean? I mean, they don't last long, but they come back every day. Yeah. That's, that's you could come in. You could come in close. You could put some over here. Yeah. I'm coming close with them. Yeah. What? On the gun.
The way you step, my stuff are coming up. You see, I won't do no. Look, you so close to step to this one just now. You step right here. All right, bye later. Yeah. Yes. Take a picture of I'm I'm recording you. You said this is this how I spring up to you now? I need to clean what up around them. And cover it too. I'm showing your butt crack. So we moved all the tulips from over there and now we're about to it's supposed to be twice as deep and twice as weed twice as wide as the bucket is in. So you need to go wider. So I don't understand how the plants don't survive that well over here. The dirt is so 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 soft, so moist and stuff. Oh, let me get some of the um the thing to turn the. Okay, one is in. It's not about the position it's in right now. It's about the growth that it's gonna give. So yeah, that's why we put it there. We trim this back. It's funny because that peony right there, I'm gonna have to move again because that's gonna shade it. It doesn't like shade. Ah! Yeah. That one right there, so I'm never gonna move again because it's, it's this one's gonna shade it, but I'll move it in um in October. I need more water than that, like. Any more water than that. <laughs> 